Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these new Michelinas. Uh, this is the Grande Meals. More food. Uh, it's the Rigatoni Alfredo with chicken and broccoli. It said it is 60% more food than our 8 ounce Fettuccine Alfredo with chicken and broccoli. So it's just basically a little bit different than that. Um, it's Rigatoni and it's 6 cheese Alfredo sauce with white chicken and broccoli. It is a 13 ounce instead of a 8 ounce. It's a 13 ounce meal, 369 grams. Yeah. Um, 22 grams of protein. We bought this at Kroger. It was only $1.99, which is pretty cheap if you ask me. Um, let's see, 460 calories, so not low calorie. You get more food for a calorie cost, right? Um, there's the other info if you want. So, cooking, I only see microwave directions, so that's fine. Before cooking, lift corner of, vent, of lid to vent. Do not re fully remove the lid, so we're just going to pull back a little bit. Uh, microwave high for four minutes. Open the lid, stir the pasta and the sauce together. Then continue to cook on high for an additional two and a half to three. I'll probably just do the two and a half. Let's stand in the microwave for one to two minutes. Remove lid, careful it's hot, and that's it. So basically vent to the corner, four minutes, stir everything together, another two and a half, and then go. And you do recover it. Yeah, and what's funny about the recovering is this lid will, um, when you pull it back, like I'm going to vent it right here where you can kind of see some of the pasta in there. I'm going to vent it there. When I pull this back to stir it up, it gets bowed. So when you lay it back down, you can't put it flat. So it's kind of funny when it says to recover. It's like you really can't recover it. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to get this in the microwave. I'll be back when it comes out. All right, so here it is out of the microwave. By the way, hate this packaging. Look at this. It, it's hard to pull. It's it's hot, so you're trying to be careful, and it's trying to scald you to death while you're trying to open the lid, and it's stuck like it's glued on with the best glue in the world. So uh, anyway, I just hate their packaging. I always have hated their packaging. So I at least it's all cardboard. It's not plastic, I guess. So I'm going to let this cool off because it's really hot. You do see pieces of chicken in there. There's a piece. I see a few pieces. There's a piece. There's a piece. Some broccoli. Um, so anyway, I'm gonna let this cool off, take it over the table, I'll be back. Hey, I gave it just a minute to cool off. Um, I've got a piece of chicken, broccoli, and two pieces of pasta in this bite. Probably can't see it, but anyway, here we go. The chicken has a little bit of a, like a rubbery texture to it. Yeah, it's not a really good dry, I mean not dry, a flaky piece of like chicken, like where you get the, the layers to it. Um, it's a little, it's a little chewy. The broccoli though was really good. It was really cooked well. It was good and soft. It still had some crunch to it, but it was still good and tender. Um, the pasta is cooked really well. Hmm. The pasta is actually cooked perfect. It's that good, uh, still firm, but not hard pasta. It's still um, al dente a little bit. I'm trying the piece of sugar. Hmm. It's chewy. I like chicken like this in um, pot pies, which is probably, Marie Callender's makes pot pies, it's probably the same chicken they use in their pot pies, the same hunks and everything. I mean, they're about, they're about the right size. Let me get rid of the piece of pot. That's about the right size for a pot pie. Um, it has that same like chewy texture. I don't mind the flavor. The flavor is really good, but boy, the texture is really chewy. Um, if you don't get a bite with broccoli, like let's say I just get this pasta and the cheese, you don't taste the broccoli really. Maybe a little bit of that flavor, but not a lot. So, I'm, I'm, that makes sense. I mean, if you think about it, but I just want to let you know the broccoli flavor is not all through like the cheese sauce. It's not cooked into the cheese sauce. It's actually the pieces of broccoli give it the broccoli flavor. So it's not in the sauce. Um, overall, not a bad meal. It's it's the same as their other meal, just a bigger version. I think the pasta is different too. Um, the chicken, you do get enough chicken especially with it being that really chewy texture you can cut them in half and, and make it double as much but um this is okay it's it's not it's not my favorite i do like the broccoli i like the pasta i like the cheese sauce uh don't really like the chicken texture because it's really really chewy but um you know i'm gonna give it a three and a half out of five um it's a little bit better than average probably because i really do like the flavor of the sauce and the broccoli and the pasta um, and the flavor of the chicken is good too. It's just the texture thing. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna give it a three and a half out of five. A little bit better than average. So I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.